Now I'm guaranteed to screw this up, but here we go. My name's Jesse. I'm fat, I'm out of shape, and I'm tired of it. So I'm getting in shape. I'm starting by eating nothing but bacon for 30 days. I'm gonna show you real quick the proper way to cut an avocado because so many people can't do this. Um, first off, remove the little nodule on top. This one's actually a little overripe. Then go and just go around the seed. Nice sharp knife really helps. Twist and you get two halves. Take the half with the seed, put it in your hand. Pop it with your knife, get in there pretty good. Be careful, don't hurt yourself. Sharp knife again really helps. Twist, pull that out discard. Then, the way I get them, just slice right down here. Pretty sure everyone does this the same way. Get a spoon, just like that, right around it. And I should have had a plate ready. Just toss that on a plate. You got your nice avocado slices. That's for later. We got mushrooms. We got cauliflower and we got broccoli. I've also got bacon, but those are the veggies that's going inside. I'm gonna eat bacon on the side because I love bacon. Right now we got these. I like to brown them up. Don't like the mushrooms too crispy. So this is ready to go. Back on the heat with that. A little bacon grease I keep in the fridge. Good butter, carry gold. All right, about a tablespoon of butter on that. Do just fine. And then you want to heat the pan until it's uh, smoking and the butter is brown. Um, you don't want it like billowing smoke, but like it is right now is uh, is pretty good. I might hold it off the heat for just a little bit. But once the butter's browned and the bubbles kind of get smaller, then uh, we're good to go. Get a fork. Sorry, the camera keeps wandering <laughs> somehow. Get a fork. Beat those up. Beat them up real good. I also use chopsticks a lot too, but fork works just fine. I'm gonna look about like that. My pan's ready. Drop that in. This is gonna go real fast now. So pay attention. Swirl that up real quick. A little bit, and then let it sit for a touch to solidify. And once it's solidified for a few seconds, just, of course this is the one I'm gonna screw up because everyone's watching. But just grab an edge here. I do like four corners and then roll some of the raw egg into there. Do that, let that solidify for a touch longer and then I go kind of the opposite four corners if it needs it. This one doesn't really need it. There you go. So we're ready to go. Now I'm guaranteed to screw this up, but here we go. There, quick flip, didn't screw it up. This is probably too much for toppings, so I'm not gonna put it all in there, but put that right around down the middle. If you're gonna put cheese in, now it's the time. Get a little more. Go like that. Then pretty much we're done. We're just gonna flop this over here and get our plate and kind of push it out onto the plate get that edge going and then roll the rest of it just like that and there we have a lovely omelet and I'm taking the camera so I can see there's my omelet right there I'm gonna throw some uh, avocado and tomato on top and a little hot sauce, but that's pretty much it. That is how you make an omelet. And now I'm gonna eat. All right, there we go. That is one lovely omelet. Hope you can see it, there's the bacon. I'm gonna eat the omelet, and I've been told that people don't like watching me eat, so I'm gonna skip that for y'all, but for watching. Real quick thought I should update at this point before we end the video. Um, today I am I'm down 46.9 pounds today so I am about 3 pounds, 3.1 pounds away from 50 pounds um, lost two days ago, three days ago 
yeah, three days ago, I was down at, um, I was only a pound and a half away. Had a little rebound. Um, lots, here, look at this graph here. This is basically how this works. It's, it's, you, know, you drop a lot, then you do this for a while, then you drop a lot, then you do this for a while. Um, so I kind of had one of those things. So I was a little disappointed, but I'm still pretty happy. I'm almost 50 pounds down. Um, it's been, uh, I think I'm on 97 days now. So I'm almost to 100 days. Um, unless my math is wrong and then today is 100. I don't, I don't really remember. Um, but I remember thinking about that the other day. So anyway, wanted to update that. I hope you enjoyed the omelet. That was probably the worst omelet I've made in a long time. If you check out the Instagram, Chili Con Carne 335 down in the description, um, you'll see a lot of my omelets. And you'll know that I'm actually telling the truth. This is really one of the worst omelets I've made. And it's probably because uh, I knew y'all were going to be watching. It's the night